Oddly enough, it was here in Franklin County where McGuire fell to his death Saturday, and oddly enough, it was while he was filming. McGuire liked to film people... On April 2nd, 1988, a tragic accident took place in Lewisburg, North Carolina. While people die every day without much public attention, the events surrounding this young man's death were startling and eerie enough to make national news. Not every day does someone die in a skydiving accident. And far, far more rarely is it because they have forgotten to put on their parachute. But never before had the accident been caught on camera, videotaped by the victim himself. An experienced skydiver on his third jump of the day, he was trying out a new helmet-mounted camera. Apparently his fascination with his new gadget, coupled with a far too relaxed, take it for granted attitude towards the infinitely more serious task at hand, led him to commit a blunder of mind and body shattering proportions. One can only wonder which thought horrified him more as he plummeted to the earth. I'm about to die? Or how could I have been so stupid as to have forgotten my parachute? It's too late now for this young man. But there's still time for us as we consider a similar question, one of even greater magnitude. Right now, each of us is hurtling towards the moment when we will die. Is there a parachute that can save us from the ultimate end of that death? And have we focused on the wrong things, the gadgets and entertainments of this world, and distracted ourselves from the real task at hand? Life is but for a moment, but eternity is forever. Welcome to The Final Frontier, a multimedia seminar that explores the ultimate questions as they relate to the mystery of life, death, and whatever lies beyond. Perhaps it's this last issue that cuts to the very core of the mystery that seems to haunt us. For whatever exists on the other side of life's horizon ultimately illuminates, or perhaps darkens, everything we do on this side of the veil. For that reason, this undiscovered country, as Shakespeare called it, has been the stuff of dreams, fantasy, mythology, and religion from the moment the first human gazed into the starry night. So with all due respect to Captain Kirk, death, not space, is the final frontier.